Hello everyone, welcome to CC's Fashion is My Passion YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, I am CC. If you are a returning viewer, subscriber, or have recently subscribed to the channel, welcome on back. And for those of you that view this channel each and every week, thank you guys so much. I certainly appreciate you. Well, this video is going to be quick, fast, and in a hurry. You all know that I always do the video showing you all what I buy from Ross, TJ, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and many other stores. So, I want to show you a few things that I recently picked up from Ross, okay? Now, if you have never shopped in Ross, give them a chance because they have some great things in this store and at an affordable price. So, let's just go on and jump into this video, okay? All right, so the first thing I want to show you is this. Now, if you've been watching my previous videos, you guys know that I recently started collecting the black Santa Clauses. My sister, Cherie, who decorates, who is the decorator in our family, she collects the black Santa Clauses, and she recently inspired me to start collecting them as well. So I saw him in Ross. He was the only, only black Santa that... Um, was sitting there all by him, him, him lonesome self. And I was like, okay, I need to add him to my collection. So as you see, he has two little gifts hanging. And then he has like some little cards right here. I guess these are supposed to be like some uh, like envelopes or whatever. And then he has on a robe. And his belt, his belt does untie. So you can tie it. It's this little, this little robe belt, his shirt with his buttons, and then he has a um, uh, uh, cap on his head with a little flower, and it comes all the way down right here, and it's got a little white ball, and then he has a cup of hot chocolate, okay? And inside of the hot chocolate, um, it's like a little snowman, and then you see the hot chocolate, then when you come down to his feet, he has on these little slippers and he has on his little pajamas with his um, his socks that are pinstripe with the red and white. And I just loved him. I, I loved him. He has his little beard here and then he's got his little glasses on and he's just darling. He's just so, so cute. So this is another Black Santa that I'm adding to my collection. And let's see, how much was Santa? Santa was $17.99. Now he is the cheapest, besides the one that I bought from Family Dollar. He is the cheapest Black Santa that I have purchased because in Marshalls, TJ Maxx, um, let's see, what other store? If you go to Hobby Lobby, if you go to, um, Ugh, Michaels, they're a little bit more expensive. Now, the ones in TJ Maxx typically run you about $19.99 to $24.99, okay? So, this is the cheapest one that I have seen, but I had to have him. I love um, figurines, and I actually love dolls. I really, really do. So, when my sister started collecting these, um, I was like, I, I've got to do the same thing. Thing because I like dolls as well. And then the, here is the back of his robe and you got the buffalo check and he's got this big band on his back, like I said, that ties around to um, his robe. So that's Santa. Isn't he cute? He cute. All right, so that is that. And then I picked up some more gifts, but I also picked up these two stockings okay and i think i'm gonna put these back here on each side of the fireplace two c's cc <laughs> so one for my son and one for myself and these were 4.99 at ross which i thought was pretty pretty cheap because you can buy these stockings and you know the ones that's back here that i have back here this one back here this one, this one came from TJ Maxx. I actually have one here and one on the other end of the fireplace. And they were $14.99. I 
So for both of these to be um, $4.99, that was pretty good. I was trying to find everybody in my family, in my immediate family, a stocking, but I couldn't find them. They didn't have all the letters, but these are really some nice, um, these are not flimsy at all, really nice, uh, heavy weighted um, stockings. And as you see right around here, you have the, all the, um, look like a sweater. Okay. And then the, uh, little loop to hang. So you can put these on the tree. You can hang them on the fireplace. Like I'm going to hang them right here. You know, you can just do whatever you want to do with them. But I like the fact that it has, uh, I like these stockings to have the letters. And like I said, one for Chris. One for CC. So that is that. And in this same bag, I found these. Now I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with these, but they came. Um, I can't tell you how much they were. If I'm not mistaken, I think they were $9.99. I threw the package away. But I'm gonna see if I can tape them up here on the fireplace. That's what I think I'm gonna do. First, I was gonna tie them on the, um, I was gonna tie them on the Christmas tree, but I think I'm gonna tape them over here on the fireplace, or either I'm gonna tape them in the windows. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but I had to have them. I thought they were really cute. They're the gingerbread. That's the gingerbread girl. And look at all the designs on her, so cute. Here's a gingerbread boy. And then you have the gingerbread house. So you got three in a uh, pack. They came together. And like I said, I believe this set was either, what did I say, $9.99, either $6.99 or $9.99. And it's almost like that um, sweatery type of material because you can uh, press them so they're not hard. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to tape them here uh, on the fireplace, okay, with along with these stockings. Okay, so that was that. And then I picked up some gifts. I picked this up for my um, sister. Either I'm going to get this to my sister or my niece, but as usual, I had to buy me one. So I don't know if I'm going to keep this for myself or if I'm going to keep or give this to my sister. But it is um, lovely. If you, I don't know if, how many of you all have ever smelled this uh, fragrance, but it smells really good. It's an old fragrance. I'm sweating, y'all. It's an old fragrance, but it's a good fragrance. And my sister and I and my niece, we love this fragrance. So this is by Sarah uh, Jessica Parker, you know, Sex in the City. And you get the perfume and you get the body spray. And this was $19.99. Okay, and the compared value was 30 bucks. So if you have never shopped in Ross and you're looking for some gifts and you don't want to spend a whole lot of money, go to Ross because I'm telling you, Ross never sells. Okay, and then I picked up this one. Now, my niece loves uh, J-Lo. So I think I'm going to give my niece this one. Again, I hope they're not looking at this video. I'm going to give my niece this one. This is um, a Glow by J-Lo. And this has the body lotion and the perfume. Okay? So what I think I'm on, they think I'm what I'm going to do, I might give her, I might give her this one and that one. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do it. But I did pick up one for my sister as well. And this also was $19.99 compared at $25. Now, when you first walk into this particular Ross that I went into when I purchased these, when you first walk in, they had a whole table full of nothing but fragrances all different types and like i said just some you know some oldies and some some newbies i actually saw it and i i regret not getting it i saw a gift set that was coach in ross 
and it was $29.99. I don't know why I didn't buy it. I mean, that's the cheapest that you're going to find a gift set of Coach. I believe it had the shower gel and the perfume. It was a little bottle of perfume and the shower gel. I wish I had a got it, but I didn't. I digress. When I went back to see if I could get it, see if I could find it, they ain't have it. That's why you got to get it when you see it. Here's another fragrance. I'm not really sure how this, how this smells, but I bought two of these. One for my son, one for my nephew. I don't know how it smells. It said for you to scratch for scent. And I did that, but I didn't smell anything. Let me see. Mm, I kind of smell it. So you get the body spray and you get the cologne. And I think my son is going to like this. I think my nephew is going to like it too. Both of these were $19.99 and the compare value was $25. So again, you don't have to break the bank if you're looking for some Christmas gifts. Listen here. Everything... Everything is so expensive right now. And so you may be feeling a little overwhelmed. You may be feeling like, you know what? I don't have a whole lot of mon money to buy everybody something in the family. You know, my money is tight right now, but I want to get my family something. Go to Ross. Go to Ross. I'm telling you, gotta be. And the thing about shopping in Ross is that you can't give up. You can't go in there and say, you know what? Ain't nothing in here. I'm not. I'm. I'm gonna leave the store. You got to look. It's that kind of store. You really got to dig through the crates and look. But as I said, this particular Ross that I went in, they had nothing but a bunch of fragrances on the table. I wanted to film that, but I was on my lunch technically, my lunch break, and I popped in there to go use the bathroom, and I saw some of. Um, this was like on three different days. But if I had been on my own time, I may have filmed. But the only problem with filming in the stores is that they always play music. And as soon as I upload a video, I get a copyright. So I didn't want to get a copyright. So I got to figure out a way to, um, I got to figure out a way to film and then do like a voiceover so that you all won't hear the music. I hate the fact that they play music in, in these stores, but they do. So anyway, let me show you the last three things that I got from Ross, okay? Um, I picked this up. Can you see it? Some black art. hope you can see her she is a beauty and this particular painting was $19.99 compared value 30 bucks I have no clue where I'm gonna hang her I might hang her over here over my couch I don't know but I fell in love with her all the designs on her top and her earrings and her scarf and then all down here $19.99 you're not gonna find too many paintings like this for $19.99 okay so we're gonna put that one there and then I picked up these two paintings how pretty girl they are so pretty both of these paintings from Ross were $14.99 and the compared value $28. But look at them. Aren't they beautiful? Look at all the design, all the color, not the design, but the color. She is so beautiful. I just love the way they did this canvas. And then you have her. I mean, just gorgeous, gorgeous. And when I initially saw both of these paintings, 
I didn't buy them right away. I didn't buy the girl or the other two young ladies right away. I saw them and what I did was I came back for them. Um, and I was hoping, I said, oh my God, I hope that they are still here. And lo and behold, they were still there. That's another thing about Ross. You can find a lot of household um, items in Ross for very, very reasonable price. And I cannot wait to hang them on the wall. I just, again, I have a lot of wall space here. We had a fire in this building in... 2009 or either 2010 and the wall a lot of the walls in here was damaged and so they came back and they redid everything so i have a lot of african art but i never rehung um my uh my pictures so i'm going to uh have my new janitor who lives next door i'm gonna have him come and hang these uh paintings for me because that's something that uh, sister girl is not good at so i'm gonna get all my art and i'll put it, all my art back up on um up on my walls but I, I i love them i love art i love um believe it or not i love home decor although i don't do videos in regards to home decor but i do like it okay so anyway i just wanted to uh, i'm fiddling with this necklace okay so let me tell y'all this necklace is a brand new necklace from akira and i believe this looks like this is a mother and child on here i'm not sure but i do believe that this necklace is some kind of um religious necklace and i didn't know it i just bought it i need to look on the package but these in akira were five dollars yes five dollars so this is my first time wearing it and it has this thick uh necklace here and then it has another necklace and then this one and they're all attached to each other these earrings came from akira as well that's another store that I don't never buy any clothing from them because they don't really particularly cater to the plus size woman, but they have the best jewelry. If you have never went into Akira, Akira, Akira can be kind of expensive. It's kind of on the high scale. Um, I do like their clothing, but they like, again, they do have a plus size section, but their clothes don't have stretch in it. And you all already know I have to have stretch. But I always go in there and get the best deals on the jewelry. Uh, whether it be some earrings, some rings, a necklace. I always find the best jewelry and it's always on sale. They have dynamite purses in there. If you ever go in there, go over to their accessory section. Go look at their shoes, their sunglasses, and their purses, and their jewelry, girl. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, they got some really, really, really cute, cute jewelry. All right, you all, I'm going to conclude this video. I wanted to show you all um, some earrings that I bought from this other store, but I got to go in the back and get it. So if you all want to wait a minute, I'm a, I've am ai been trying to show you all that for the longest. Just hold on one second. I'm going to go get it. I'm going to show you all this real quick, and then I'm going to end the video. So stay tuned. Stick around. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, this was not in the plan, okay? This wasn't in the plan of the video. But I've been meaning, I've been wanting to show you all this for a while, and I always forget. This is um, some jewelry that I bought from this store called Lovisa, and they're located in the mall. And if you all have ever shopped in, like, Claire's or anything like that, well, they are an upscale, like, uh, rendition of Claire's, Okay. 
cute stuff. But before I show you those, let me show you these, girl. Girl. Take these off. You got these earrings on a whole vibe. I ordered these earrings from, um, I can't even think of the lady name, but she's on Instagram. If I find her information, I'll list it. Just these earrings are just a whole vibe, girl. Now, you all know, if you know me, know me. You all know that. I like anything <laughs> different and eccentric. Look at these. You got to be ready to wear these. These, these ain't the type of earrings that they ain't for everybody, okay? You got to have a whole type of vibe for these. But look at them. All of this fabric. Girl, I wore these... Um, I wear these to a party or out or something. And people were like, are those earrings? And I know it looked like a whole bunch of just fabric. You know what I'm saying? But I love these earrings. I love them. And so the lady who made these, <clears throat> she cut her hand really, really bad and had to have like, I don't know, like 80 stitches or something like that. So when I have actually ordered them, because she hand makes them, when I ordered them, she had cut her hand really bad. And so I, it took me about like a month to get these. And I kind of forgot about it. And then she sent me an email explaining to me why my earrings was on delay. So she had them on her website, but she didn't have them, have them in stock. She had to make these for me, and she couldn't because she cut her hand really bad. But when I tell you she was professional, when I tell you she was uh, explaining, you know, what had happened, and um, so now I follow her on Instagram. So I will list her Instagram page in the description of this video or in the comment, uh, in the comment section of this video so you can go on there and look and see all the things that she makes. Not only does she make these type of funky earrings she also made purses that is just like out of sight okay i mean purses is just doing the most but i like me everybody is not down with this you know this is not for everybody it, it you have to have a certain type of personality okay to wear something like this everybody is not gonna wear this everybody is not th this is just not for everybody you know what i'm saying but i've been wearing jewelry like this for a while and i love it because i don't like to see myself coming and going i like to be different i told you all before i like to walk into the room and have people look at me and go hmm okay maybe yeah maybe not but the point is, is that it's me expressing who I am. You know, I don't do what everybody else do. I'm not trying to look like everybody else. I'm CC baby, okay? I'm CC. So CC got her own thing going on. But some people do like this type of jewelry. So that's why I'm showing it to you. And again, as I said, I'm going to list her information. Now we're going to go on and get into this little bag of treats, okay? And then we're going to end the video. So again, this... Uh, store is called La Visa. Now, I don't know how many of you all have one, but if you do, check them out. But before I show you that, let me show you these earrings here. Are they, is these by La Visa? No, this, this came from Akira. Look at them. Look at those. Cute, honey, cute. These were so here we go with this sale. The final sale, the pink tag. You see that? They're showing it. it was, they were $10. They are so, so cute. So I'm going to show you what these look like. Let's take these off. I can't even remember how much I paid for those, for these earrings with all the um, fabric on them. 
They want cheap. I can tell you that much. See all this fabric. All different, just all different kind of fabric. Same way over here. Just, just different, girl. Just different. I love that. Okay, I'll put those here. Let's see. What's down? Something else down in this bag. Oh, no. That's it. Okay, so these are some earrings from Akira. Trying to move fast. Because I, I didn't intend to show you all these, but it just popped in my head. And it's been back there sitting on my data room table. And I'm like, you know, I need to show the people these. Oh, this is a whole vibe. And then you have... The little gold right here that's peeking through. Okay, let me see if I can fix this. I have a whole bunch of earrings I could show you all. Um, a lot of people have been asking me to do an earring haul, but I don't know how many people would actually watch it. I barely can get people to watch these videos, so I don't know. I would have to fix that part of it. But how cute are those? And I definitely have something to wear with these, honey. Mmm. She giving. She cute. She cute. She is cute. And we're going to put these back on the cardboard until it's time to wear them. She giving, girl. She is giving. Yes, ma'am. I have a whole lot of red to wear with those. Okay. I'm going to put these back in the little bag. And now we're going to get into these. Okay. What's in here? Nothing. Okay. All right. So, I bought these a while ago. Okay. I've been meaning them to haul them. I never did. These are a beauty. They are just beautiful. So I'm going to try these on. And I have some other earrings that I bought from them too. But I already wore them. So I think you all, I may have showed them to you all and told you all where I got them from. Look at the detail in these earrings. They are gorgeous, honey. Just gorgeous. And I have a pink pantsuit. And I think you all may have seen me um, wear these with my pink pantsuit. And let me just say this, honey. These earrings are not cheap. No, ma'am. They are not cheap. I believe... How much were these? They don't have a price on them. Mm, they said it was $20. They are so, so pretty. So pretty. I just love the detail on here. Just love that. I hope everybody is doing well. Oh, my God. It's so many people that I know that is sick with COVID. You know, I told you all I was sick uh, week, two weeks ago with it. Week before, last week with it. Oh, my goodness. It's just so many people are sick with it. A lot of my friends are sick with COVID. Please wear your mask, honey. Wear your mask. See all the little diamonds very very dainty and cute okay so that's that pair and then i bought these i haven't worn these yet the ones that i'm showing you all i have not worn yet and these are a little heavy 
little bit. Stay sharp. I like these. What you all think about these? And I have a lot that I can wear with this too. I love big earrings. I love earrings that, that hang, that dangle. Yes. And again, this was all from this store called Lovisa. L-O-V-I-S-A. They are located in most malls. So if you are out and about in the mall and you're looking for some earrings um, for a night, you know, you have a, a, a an event and... Um, for uh, excuse me, for um, dressy earrings, go into La Visa and check them out. And then I bought this ring. See, haven't had it, haven't worn it. Um, I think this ring was ten dollars. Okay, and then I bought a black ring. Might not fit on there. And I believe this one was $10 as well. And these earrings, I absolutely fell in love with. You already know why, because they're one of my favorite colors, which is red. Okay, don't try not to drop the back. My mother said, I don't know how you put on earrings and you don't have a mirror. I'm so used to taking earrings on and off. How pretty. Very, very pretty. Put the other one on. Trying not to drop the little bags. Did I drop them? Oh no, I got them. Yeah, child, I'm so used to putting on earrings. These are so, so pretty. Look at all the detail. You, I mean, it's just, it's just the wow factor for me. I just love items that's just doing the most. I just do. That's just me. And you may agree or disagree. I don't know. But look at the flowers all the way around here. I mean, it's just so, so, so different. You just not going to see yourself coming and going. Because here's the thing. Most people are not going to buy these kind of earrings because they're just going to say, oh, that is just doing the most. But I think they, ooh. sorry about that. I think that they are gorgeous. The little flowers, just gorgeous. They are pretty. I do not know why my cat is hollering. Why is she hollering? I'm having a baby. I don't know, that cat, something going on with her too. My cats are old. No, you are never ready to put them down. That's the only bad part about having animals. When they get sick or they get old, like people, you know, a lot of stuff start going wrong with them. You got to put them down. I hate that. I always say, I'm not getting another animal. I'm not getting another animal. And end up getting another animal. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I had it in there. There we go. I like these as well. So these are that, um, the animal print. I like these as well really 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 cute 
So again, check this store out. L-O-V-I-S-A. Lovisa. And again, if you're just looking for some really nice earrings, just know you might spend a little penny, okay? I don't want you all to think you're going to go in there and get earrings that's going to cost $5. It's not the beauty supply house, okay? They're not going to be $5. But they do have a lot of earrings that are on sale as well. And these are very, very lightweight. That's another thing I wanted to say. They're very, very lightweight. And these just, they're a snap down closure. Okay? All right, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. I know that the views um, lately on my videos have just not been the greatest. I don't know what that's, uh, what that's about. But guess what? We're going to keep on pressing on, right? We ain't came this far together to now say adios amigos, okay? I'm not ready to say that as of yet, okay? Now, I don't know, you know, when I be tired of doing YouTube, but right now, I'm enjoying myself. This is like an out for me. This is a hobby. Um, it's not all about making money, okay? I do make money off of here. It's not a whole lot of money. But the little that I get, I am grateful and thankful for. And by you viewing my videos, watching my ads, you help me continue to earn a little coin off of YouTube, okay? So I really want to say thank you guys for that. Thank you all for supporting me. I always say it to you all because I mean it from the bottom of my heart. For those of you that don't support that's always negative, always has something to say, which that really has not been happening a lot, okay? And I'm really glad about that. So here's the thing. I don't have a whole lot of views, but I don't have a whole lot of back and forth with people no more either. So I don't know. That, you know, I think it's, you got to take the good with the bad. You know what I'm saying? So... It is what it is. But in any event, those of you that enjoy this platform, that come back each and every week to look at the videos, thank you so much. And for those of you, again, that maybe not, you know, filling the channel that much, it's okay. Stay away. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I, you know, I would rather have people that want to be here and want to watch the, the content than for those that really don't want to watch but just always want to be negative you know who needs that you know it's good vibes over here it's good energy and that's the way that i want to keep it so thank you guys for watching i appreciate you i really really do i hope you had a great restful fun fun fulfilled weekend please don't forget wear your mask wear your mask wear your mask wear your mask mask and get vaccinated get vaccinated i am going this week to get my last well it probably ain't gonna be the last but i'm going to get now that i'm over covid i'm gonna go and get my booster shot this weekend and i'm taking chris so he can get his last one my mama has had hers and um I'm just going to keep getting vaccinated. That's all I can tell you all. I'm going to keep getting vaccinated and I'm going to keep wearing my mask. And I let my guard down. I stopped wearing my mask. Everybody at my job is sick with COVID. You know, it was right after the Thanksgiving holiday. And they told people that it was going to be an up, uh, up rise in COVID because it was Thanksgiving and people were with family. And I was one of those people that got caught in that okay so just make sure you wear your mask if you don't have any home testing kits see if you can get them because you definitely need to take them um i took one um i've taken four um but just do what you can to stay safe and stay healthy so you guys know where i'll see you i will see you in the next next video um which probably will be next sunday We'll be uploading another video. I do not know what it's going to be. It might be an ASOC haul. The, the video that I told you I wanted to do showing you all the items from the summer. Or it might be another lingerie she in haul. I'm not for certain. But in any event, I can't wait to see you again. And I hope that this is not our last time interacting. Please leave me a comment. Give this video a thumbs up. 
And I'll see you when I see you in the next video. God bless you. Have an awesome week ahead. Be safe. Be blessed. Bye-bye. Mwah.